Okay, this is a 2006 Traverse, Chevy Traverse, and... It's a 2009. 2009, okay. And it has supposedly a bad spark plug and wire, or no, I should say boot. So we're going to replace the coil, and we're going to replace all the spark plugs in this car. But you know what you have to do to get down to the spark plugs and the coils? We must first move, remove the platinum right here first. So this is the first thing we're going to... After we took all, yeah, we took these all the hoses other... and put them all up out of the way here, so we can just lift this right straight up. And we had here. to disconnect the throttle body. Throttle body, yeah. We've got a couple of connections here that'll have to be disconnected too, so we'll do those two along the way. All right, here we go. So 13 millimeters to get all the sockets that are in there, right on there. Just put it on this ratchet here. So we'll just go along and get all these. I've already loosened them a little bit, so they're not that tight on there. And basically. We're going to take the bad boy off. I don't know what I'm getting myself into, but we'll see. We'll see. So now that all these six bolts are out of there, and these all right in here, you got to look down over here. There's going to be one more right oh, you gotta stay there. here. Uh, where the heck was it? Right there. Was it down? Okay, the now that the plenum's off, the next job after the plenum comes off is you can get to the injectors now. And you can, I mean, these are the coils here for each cylinder here. So, and number six was the one which would be this one here. We need to pull this one out and change it with the spark plug. That's the one that's missing. So, that's the vital one. But we're going to pull them all out. And the leash is doing it this time. The light back here so these guys can see me. Okay, there's the plug right there. You just have to go in this way and line up the. Line up the prongies with the coil pack. You push it in part ways, and then see this thing on the side here, the tab, you push in on that, and that draws it the rest of the way into the injector. And that's All it. The rest now is just to uh, start reattaching uh, hoses and everything. We got a bolt that's got to go into this one and hold it in place. All kinds of goodies here. There we go. Let's go this over the top. That goes right there. Ooh, does that go in very far? Holy cow. There we go, it's in there. Okay, the hose for the throttle body goes into the air cleaner over there. And a few more hoses that should be ready to go. All right, done. Okay, so we got the engine back together, all the hoses back on. She's doing an oil filter change and oil, so that's, that's good. Happy for her, good for her. Good for you, Alicia. All right, so now the proof is in the pudding. Will it start? <laughs> or will it start and blow up? <laughs> nah, I'm confident it'll she'll run just fine. Oopsie, did I put that upside down? Nope. She'll run just fine. Okay. Will it run? We'll live to die another day. It was running like terrible before and had a bad mess. Now she's smooth as silk. Okay. Shut her down. Sounds good. Well, there you go, folks. That's how you replace she spark plugs. And coil yeah, I had one coil pack, the one that was over here and number cylinder six was bad. We replaced that one too. So there you go, folks. That's how you do it. Thanks for watching. And, uh, if you like the video give me a thumbs up and uh leave any comments if you so do decide to or choose and we'll see you next video